It's a rural two lane road, but neighbors living along it say it's more like a highway with fast cars just racing by. Yeah, ABC Action News reporter Heather Lee live tonight exposing this problem and driving Tampa Bay forward. Heather. Well, neighbors say they have been able to get the county out here to install sidewalks and paint those double yellow lines right there to keep people from passing each other. But they say that this area and this road just cannot keep up with how fast it's growing. The speed limit on Sunset Lane in Lutz, 40 miles per hour, but... The speeding goes on and on and on. For several decades, Bruce Kuiper has watched this road get busier. Since my children got hit here and I had to pry them out of the truck, in my front yard, it's been an issue for me. It's a straight shot from US 41 to Livingston Avenue with just one stop sign in between. It's a very favorite shortcut to get to Wesley Chapel. He says numerous people have been rear ended trying to pull into their driveways. Cody Smith says he was T boned when someone tried passing him. It actually moved my driver's seat into my passenger seat. Kuiper even bought a special mailbox. I can stand here on the sidewalk and open the door from the back and retrieve my mail. Lowering the speed limit and getting more enforcement is what they'd like to see. Smith says the speed limit on Livingston drops to 35 in Pasco County. They're always patrolling that section, the Pasco section of it. It's an ongoing problem all the time, and I, I don't, really don't want to see somebody get killed out here, particularly a child. Now, the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office says it does take concerns like this very seriously, and oftentimes they will send a deputy out to take a look at these concerns. That's exactly what they plan on doing in this situation. For now, we're live in Lutz. Heather Lee, ABC Action News.